is a quality but unto god he is that goodness is his essence his nature that is he is he will never change that was that is who he is and that is why the bible says is equal equal get the faithfulness of the lord new every morning and he began to go with me all this what i'm saying is that so put on a kind of countenance as you have been benefited from god's goodness i will come back to that do not always be twisted in your face as if you have never come in contact with the goodness i will tell you humanly meaning mentality those things that when we lay our hands upon those things those places that when we are able to get there the achievement that when we able to lay our hands and we may be thinking we may be telling that oh that is the area i have seen the goodness of the lord in my life but i want to tell you that even as we are sitting down in that condition i will present unto you that you are still enjoying god's goodness hallelujah who from us say hallelujah so god does not go on fasting he does not kneel down before any other person to pray for him for him to be able to have the grace to show kindness unto people and i said it again even though i disagree with one of the christian philosophers that tries to talk about god's goodness as moral aspect of god god's goodness is not the we can never take it to be the moral aspect of god it is the essence the nature of god because it is that statement can only be applied unto man moral aspect because when we are talking about the attributes of god there are certain attributes of god we can god can share with us and that one one of them we call it communicable attribute of god that is that of goodness you see it in god and you see it in man but the source of god's goodness in man the source of goodness of man is god is the source when there is no goodness flowing from god into any being my human beings man can never function in that aspect so that is exactly number three please do i still have something to say before i mention a few things because so unto us quality so Mama Bo Brother, don't have so of a relaxed atmosphere. Don't have of a relaxed atmosphere. I say as long as the Lord live it, and as long as goodness is his essence and his nature and his quality, goodness of the Lord shall never cease in your life. I say shall never cease in your life now let me tell us one thing because we christians sometimes we behave in a very funny way when we are talking about goodness when does god show us his goodness look up god is a good god on our best days and on our worst days so it's not a good god and that is one of the things that is very difficult in our lives today to express when the going is good i'm not saying this to blame anybody but it is only the grace of god that will be able to move from this level just praise the lord i stand before you today to praise your name what the lord has done unto me oh it is so marvelous I can me ma ke ko kwero ju service ni sanga 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 ni egutum abasi ono tum praise the lord that is your good how many people will be able to see god's goodness when the going is the opposite so what i'm trying to say is that never you allow to yourself by any means or any way no matter na pa baba god is still a good god in our bad days as well as a good god in our good days how many people accept that can i see your hands up how many people agree with them agree with me can i see your hands up okay let me tell you let me tell you 
when you don't have 10 kobo in your pocket and you are lamenting you have been thinking you have been thinking how you will be able to cope up then there is life in you do you see that that life is God's goodness do you know that woman for support the force who you for zero and you never support any simple or over to the front of us hallelujah come and see the Lord is good hallelujah come and see the Lord is good and there is no thing he can not do the goodness of God. Let me show you common, common things. How to recognize the goodness of God. How will you be able to recognize God's goodness in your life so that you will continue to trust in Him so that you will continue to believe in him so that you will resist the devil anytime satan is coming around when you face a condition that is so painful unto you and the devil will come around to tell you that ah i'm inform your soul to do the afusun ekeke ka ugo ko basi aba epa ka ba do ntum epa ka ba do ntum then you will be able to resist the devil so let me show there are so many ways how we can recognize the goodness of God in our lives. But number one, let me tell you one, one of the things we can ways of recognizing the goodness of God is in nature. In nature. Nature. Can I have Genesis chapter 1 and verse number 31? God saw that all he had made and it was very good and there was evening and there was morning. That is six days of creation. Now, God saw all that he had made, and it was what? Good. And it was what? Good. Okay, and it was what? Very good. Hallelujah. Very good. So, we soon get about the business, the business, the business, the business, the business, the one of the things that I want to make a young come on to me, maybe I want to come. Kenyan Deminka. There is a way I am driving every one of us to before we get into prayer session. That get the Lord is so good. The goodness of the Lord is in nature. What do we mean by nature? The created order. 
what the Lord granted. The Bible told us, Abuntum, after the creation on the sixth day, the Lord saw that everything was created, was very what? Good. That shows the goodness of the Lord. In other words, everything the Lord created to do the product of his goodness. He created everything to be good. Everything. That is why for or That is why for God's plan for humanity for the entire world is for the world to enjoy his goodness. That is exactly number two. Since we don't have much time. Number two, let us look at how we can answer, how we can recognize the goodness of the Lord. Number two, in answered prayers. I'm coming back to the reading. In answered prayers. How many people in the house? Please, can you look up unto me? Okay, so I wouldn't bother. How many people in the house? Can I see your hands up? How many people in the house? in the house? How many people in the house? One funny thing is that do not think that God will use one day to answer all the prayers. He will never. Because you prayed for certain things and the answer does not come doesn't mean that God will not answer that prayer. God will never answer all the prayers we made unto him on one day. He will never. He has time for everything. Okay, let me have Psalm number 40, verse number 1. This is a man, I waited patiently for the Lord. He turned to me and heard my cry. Can we read together? I want to go. How many people in the house, once upon a time, you cried out unto the Lord and he heard your prayers? Can I see your hands up? Now, I want you to understand that for God to answer your prayer, answering of prayer is a product of God's goodness. I will move my finish him for you. What I get here, Tim, is a same. So, you need them for Tonga Trump, but to Tonga narrate the condition of Nanaka Tonga Katai to it. I got to want to make Tonga Tonga Matonga Matta, Jenica, Mian, and some ball, and so it dismisses you without any positive response. It is only somebody that will show kindness that will respond unto it and will react and will respond to your plea. That is exactly so. When you pray, I'm telling you ways to recognize God's goodness in your life so that you may not be myopic in any way, thinking that you have never seen the Lord's goodness in your life. He's a faithful God. You prayed the other day when you were in school, you prayed unto God to give you the ability to succeed and to graduate. You graduated. Is it not God's goodness? It is by God's goodness. That is exactly you yourself are sitting down here. The youth fellowship president, you prayed for God to give you a wife. And to, pray, to give you the money to conduct your traditional marriage and wedding. And then, this is you are a senior man in marital world. As far as marriage is concerned, very soon you will be made paramount ruler in the world of marriage. What, what do you think that was the secret? Do you remember when you were praying, crying? You cried out unto the Lord before you know it. Either the Lord passes through somebody and provided that unto you. What do you think that is? That? Do you think that it is because we're so fortunate? Or it comes as a fortune or as luck? That is not luck. It is the product of God's goodness. So there is no man, there is no woman in this house that have a move. We are talking about the goodness of the Lord. And the goodness of the Lord shall never stop in your days. He shall continually continue. continue. So the generation to come will still come and be partakers of God's goodness. The people in the presence will still enjoy the goodness of the Lord. And the Lord does not show goodness at the same time. So David said, I cried out unto the Lord. Take a look in your family. Take your back minds. When you were so praised, when you, when you were so disturbed, so that is an aspect of God's goodness. Church, hallelujah. Hallelujah. 
Ganado, I am saying that to liberate you, to liberate myself in that myopic understanding. Because most of the time, any thing you need, you must send a courier on board of what we need. You need to be able to Yeah, Amen. Every day of our lives, we are enjoying God's goodness in our lives. Number one, number two is that of answering prayers. Please let me have number three. Okay, okay. Do you have another psalm? Can we read Psalm number thirty-four? Uh -huh. Psalm number thirty-four. This psalm, uh -huh. thank you, my brother. Let me explain something on that very point. Psalm number thirty-four, which is the passage for consideration, and especially verse number eight. David, who wrote this psalm, wrote this psalm in reference to the perilous situation that the writer, that is David, found himself. Come, test and see. David again in front. So I come here for get me uh for get test and see that the Lord is good. And he when we're again in front of the man, you better cried out unto the Lord. But because of the goodness of the Lord, and then he made a clarion call. Mufedi and you might have said today the lord is assembling us this day and i stand just as david did to give you a call to come and test and see how the lord is so good as we are going to pray god will answer us I say, as we are going to pray for ourselves, pray for our families. Through the goodness of the Lord, our prayers shall be answered. Amen. I say, our prayers shall be answered. Amen. So, David, I waited upon the Lord. Now, let me tell you. Let me tell you. For David to say, test. And see, let me explain two things in that place. The differences of knowing something and experiencing something are different thing entirely you can never testify to anything you have never had the experience of you only testify to something experience come test and see so for you the young people you if your man for this is your boy how many people in this house please let me put uh no examination how many people in this house have ever had the experience of god answering prayers can i see your hands up oh we found out to me in your experience because when you don't have experience of the goodness of the lord you will never testify to it sister sister Okay, okay, okay. Thank you. Very much. Good to have you today. So that is exactly today. As we are going to pray, I want to announce to you, I want to announce to your situation that if you had never had the experience of the goodness of the Lord in answering prayers today, this first Sunday of March, you will have that experience. So that as David had the experience and then he made a call unto other people. Abu Edi, Edi Tabe, no, I say, Nang Jehovah, and I'm so bold, I'm fun. I'm afraid the Lord shall show you his goodness. So that after this prayer, you will tell it to your colleagues. So that after this prayer, you will share it with your friends. The goodness of the Lord. Amen. 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 A good of Ubunia experience can make it your mama, who women for the gift of life, the gift of salvation, and a lot of blessings, even favor, are the proof of God's faithfulness. So, for no matter who women for this life that you live, it is not because you know how to combine good diet, it is not because you have the best doctor who can examine the level of your health. I'm not saying that those things so that the doctors that are here in the house and the nurses and the medical personnel will never crucify me. 
All those things are working together. But I want to let you know the one who is able to take all these blessings to perfection is only who? God. And the healing, the life, life that we live comes as a result of God's goodness. So you are enjoying God's goodness. Even as we are sitting down here, bros, you hear what I'm saying? This life that you live. I do not say that uh, will, by the time I will buy a car and uh, finish my secondary school, go to university, uh, my mother will send me, my parents will send me to study abroad. That is when you begin. Even at this very age, do you see the goodness of the Lord? This beautiful tie that you are using and this white shirt. Look at how you look so nice. And you look so nice. You look so organized, so presentable, so adorable. When you go to the street, you see some of the children of your age walking tatatly like that. When you look at yourself, you see so handsome. This is the blessings, a proof of God's faithfulness. So from the day in our womb, we enjoy God's faithfulness. Can you celebrate the Lord in the house? Celebrate the Lord. It's nice. Yes. Life, favor, everything. And the proof of God's faithfulness. Whatever that is left, God's faithfulness and God's goodness shall take it to perfection. I've taken much of your time so that we go. So that Psalm number 31, verse number 9, said a lot of things, good things. Finally, brother, I still have another one. How great. Okay, let me read that Psalm. Thank you very much, my sister. How great is your goodness? which you have stored up for those who are sorry for those who fear you which you bestowed in the sight of men on those who take refuge in you so sam is telling us how great god's faithfulness is all about let me have the next one perhaps that one is the last so we recognize god's faithfulness god's that is god's goodness in our lives in our family in his providence and provision in the way that is when we are talking about providence and provision of god i'm trying to explain it in the next line in the way he sustains us each day psalm jeremiah chapter 29 verse number 11 and the lord will say for i know the plan that i have for all you can i have it so that we return for i know the plan i have for you declares the lord plans to prosper you and not to harm you plans to give you hope and a future and that is all about god's goodness so every day now i see coming in now i didn't song now papa kekong ya kan wan kusen kekere nyini face ke kusen em i do mboku keru bote kewe kwa mboti kwe wa nye kwe rong poro nye mnofo ni yong ifyo kwa banga mpom mponi do basi mwa furura la basi ntidi yoko wu aso kwa kaiso ijira basi yemi kuwe mfo use ne mamu biak fi na basi so kwa fo fon yafo use ne kari mi bera kufo kti tapi fo so si a basi so kwa fo fon yen yen use ne diri ammi bera idoko frini kam posi yoko wu ke paro pros aba ini yon ngwa do ngwa na ngwa na ngwa na ntomi nong iba ba five five iba god is still loving us his goodness is still in our lives who said no even any no item of voice and mama kia bongo boko kari ata madam and you know that are in one to me for friend madam and you know what my mother even to me the goodness of the lord is still there even in the mongo mongo fair the goodness of the lord is there clap hand for jesus he's good <laughs> hallelujah for those of you young people some say some of you will be regretting I regret. I don't know why the Lord has sent me into this family. You try to compare yourself with your schoolmate. Their parents are blessed. Eh, they will be coming to dormitory eh, with the basket of indomie. Eh, eh, with the macaroni. Eh, with this. Look at how. Eh, their school fee. Eh, na, 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 na. I regret coming to this family. I don't know why the Lord has selected me. No, I mean the man who for women. No, now the condition you are facing trying to compare yourself with any other person you regret of coming to that family does not deny the fact that goodness of the lord is there for you to be alive in the hands of your parents you are still enjoying the goodness of god so stop comparing yourself 
then you go to school. Because this one is wearing koi koi shell pass, koi koi shoe, tai 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 tai. And then you are wearing this low self pass. He said that God's goodness in who tells you for the fact that you can march majestically and a cup of fever shows that do you know how a lot of people that are rolling that are scrolling on the bearings of the car? You walk together. When you are so strong enough, that is exactly who you are. If your parents are able this day, anyway, they may do me the same way that they are. Say the you never saw what you are going see. Everything in life is turn by turn. You can never take it away from men. The problem is that some of us don't want to lay our hand to stand on the little truth that we know. Life is turn by turn. Anybody who is on stage today, one day will forget another person will come in. And that is exactly how we live our life. One of the things I try to let you know that God is so kind. Please pardon me because a lot of people say, Pastor, is it going to preach forever? Is it not going to stop this preaching? You are looking at your time. Doesn't he remember that go with the young boy do for us in fun? I rebuke you with that spirit because some of you I know. Some of you that are thinking like that. As you are calling fire, me I don't I don't I don't know the call fire. Church hallelujah. Church hallelujah. Whatever condition, that's the final one. The final one occurred. So that in Ibong Ibong come. In forgiveness. This is one of the ways that we have seen the goodness of the Lord in forgiveness. John chapter 1, first John chapter 1, Bible book. If we confess our sins, he is faithful and just and will forgive us of our sins and purify us from all unrighteousness. That is so funny do about sin. I'm funny do about sin. Get it from me, young boy. They feel a quick walk up a kunek. They feel a kunek. I tell for fun on all wood. I get you off and me back to the young boy. I'm so bold. You know, I'm funny do about sin. You know, I'm going If from this house, I want to, I don't want, whether I don't want to believe that I am right, but I don't want to believe that I am wrong. I am not working through for about seven years. I'm not working for me. I'm not working for me three years ago. But I'm not working for me three years ago. Are we finding the word? The thing is still in their heart. If God would have acted that way or behaved that way, you know me. By the way, me the one from Mama Boraka Borum Boron Ubega Finan Ubega Mini Boran Yame. Some of you are very funny. Some of you are still custodied crushes in your heart, even as you are sitting down here. Three years ago, one year ago, two months ago, case seven four. If the Lord would have behaved that way, you know, by the way, me the one from forgiveness of sin. Is a proof of God's goodness. Can you raise up your hands? Eta we ji over se ko ise ko. Ko no ne me eta we ji over se ko e yong e se te ji over. Why say no name? I'm in my dark room, I'm in my so pretty bum. I come to eat swam. If you get to go, I'm a fool. You go what to feel funny do? Hey, funny you what feel funny do, man? About seven years you don't funny do. Kid me the mama. I hear you what you funny do, man. The God of goodness shall manifest his goodness in a time in the name of Jesus Christ. Hallelujah. The goodness 
of the Lord. Okay, y'all go and say. We sing together. The goodness of God shall transform your life today. This month, the Lord shall show you His kindness.
Praise your voice and appreciate God for his protections over your life and your family for the past month of February. I could remember the first Sunday of February we came together in this manner and we interceded on before the Lord asking him to protect us and we have seen the Lord doing it unto us. Come and your bang family for come and your come and your bang family for appreciate God for his goodness. Just appreciate God. Somebody should be on the mic to help us. Appreciate God for his goodness. It is a no my style. Come about see, come about see. Kenyan Matai Chibo and Yasa song. Come and your bang and song in them. Come and your bang with Yasa and Yakabaruna of Yen. Come and your Miki Yaka for Roke Kambamfana. He did not allow us to involve in a situation that would have needed thousands of myra. Tell God thank you. Tell God thank you. Appreciate him. Come on, yeah. tell him thank you for the church. Raise your voice and begin to appreciate God. See, appreciate God's goodness in your life. When you were traveling, the Lord was so faithful unto you. Some of the blessings of the last month, we did we we, we didn't deserve them. But because of the mercies and the love of God, I appreciate God for the church. Tell God thank you for the women. Tell God thank you for the, the men, the youth. Come about see, come about see. Come about see. Don't allow yourself. Don't allow your eyes to be blinded. Come on, come on, yeah. Can you phone up on? Can you phone up on? What he said. I'm in the world. Jesus, I can't hide. I'm in the world.
place of prayer. But we are standing on the victory that Jesus Christ won the devil. He wants to say, Father, even right inside this hall, if there is anything representing the devil, any kingdom that is here, hidden before our mortal eyes, Father, in the name of Jesus, we take authority over them. None of them shall make fib. The one of the you are morning to honor the report, we seize the understanding. One of the whatever that is going on in the house, feed us in the headquarters, feed us. We cut out every contact, every spiritual contact laid in the sea, the spiritual contact in the air, the one on the land, the one in this environment, in the church environment. We disconnected them all, then we are connected to heaven. In that prayer, announce an open heaven. I will never pray under a closed heaven. Because this day in the life of this prayer, the reign of God's goodness is going to fall. Every man is going to be baptized. Your spirit is going to be soaked by the goodness of the Lord. Can you raise up your hand and begin to make that prayer? Oh, 
evil family pattern. They want to push my children to suffer sin. They want to push my male child to suffer sin. Let it be broken. Yahabiara, Yahabiara, raise your voice. Say my children shall never suffer what my father suffered. I shall never suffer what my mother suffered negatively. Every evil family pattern, evil family pattern in the family of my mother. They try to put me so that I suffer the same way that my father suffered. It shall never stand. Raise your voice and pray. Amen. Church, amen. amen. When I see mothers and fathers in the house, let me say this, I am inspired to see it. When I see mothers and fathers in the house, told him with this prayer upon I beat it you. The set of the people people want to come and go with me to Jamaica. Need on the favor want come. Evil family pattern. Eh, didn't you see? Go family and more the folk take a more seven to. A foot to your cap and a panic more than a cabaca family. Take a no son to the window make it for you. Okay. Eh, is that how their family is? Eh, yes. And they walk toward that. That family, evil family pattern is broken. Pushing our male children into that pattern is broken. Amen. Forcing our female children into that pattern is broken. Amen. Every evil family pattern that is haunting our children, that is haunting operating in our families, they want our children, irrespective of our effort, to be like the generation ago in the family. That family covenant in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth is broken. Even if somebody is paid to activate that spirit to work negatively, that spirit is, that covenant is broken. I say it shall never operate again. I announce a release from that pattern. That pattern is taken away from your family. And our children shall never be affected. In the name of Jesus. May take a say on wrong of your hand. A Yamino Nitonson, no, I told you don't wrong of you. I don't want to monarch and say, Sana, go in Yaki, a Yam no, no, I said, Woka family, you're a seven toro, Yan Yabiara. I can be to Ivanado, a photo. May take a more case of Antoretta for my. Nanga Woka family, you're a good woman. Nang Doka Wamuson, Nanga Kaba Kemen. That pattern today is broken. Is broken. Our children shall never suffer what our forefathers suffered. Our female children shall never suffer what their mother suffered. Every evil family pattern, hunting, making sound, working together, working tirelessly, affecting our family, affecting our children. I stand on this altar today. I make a decree. I make a pronouncement. The pattern is broken. The pattern is destroyed. I said the pattern is destroyed. Evil family pattern is destroyed. In Jesus' name. In Jesus' name. Oh God. Sing with me. Oh God. If somebody knows that John pick up Let me sing. 
Christ of Nazareth, I scattered you. And I will never see you again. And you will never repeat again. In the legacy to Tori from today, I am free. Raise your voice and make that prayer. Raise your voice and make that prayer. Thank you. 
sit. We are the mighty man on the That is the enemy within. This time we want to pray. Satan is a very crafty enemy. I give it in a 
devil, we don't want to touch the person. We don't want to touch him. We don't want to touch her. We want to use him and fight him. Man won't see cocky. Me wo to talk with you. Do go say ben diani idam. Mpo ipe ben na meeting mpo apa rokari. O send me fin away. Nta ni come bang enemy with them. They are coming to pray and bang bang. Idu do. Every time problem in marriage, it is not the wishes and ways grab. The devil ben one kind character. Damn. At the man yonga koto. At the. At this one the young person. Man the other the young person. Ah, answer. Mama, you go for a come born or panic or where the fruits and the yaki back in the country. Where the children die, he doesn't fool. He wants to pray. I'm serious about it. Enemies of progress within me, not outside. Panic, I've been facing again. And he better walk in panic. But also, I'm sending you a sermon and I'm going to send you a sermon. And yes, he better walk in panic. I will see whatsoever thing the devil planted in my life and is using that. To stop me making progress in life. Lord, liberate me. Can we read before we start to pray? One, two, go. You are not responsible for that. But because the devil is sown in into your life. Anywhere you go, that good thing shall come forth from that place. That particular lifestyle, that particular character will come to play. And the people will never see you. The character will never allow. Mboro, yaka. This one has nothing to do with witches and witchcraft. Enemies we them. And Satan have been bodo up your one more way to your daughter, eighty. Madame, my young, not young, Miss Miko. Let me be foolish. But the foolishness tomorrow shall make sense. Church, praise the Lord. Enemies of progress within me. What so whatever whatsoever the devil is using to stop me from making progress in life, unstoppable growth. Oh God of heaven, by thunder, by fire. Liberate me from that spirit. Father, today, every enemy of progress within me, from now, scatter. God, show me your goodness. Shall we begin to pray? You may take it for granted.
and pray whatever whatever every day in good and prematurely because of that character that character they say okay they use that because of that character they stop you from making progress in life promotion they deny it tell God liberate me Enemies of progress within a man. 
sometimes we move forward to no direction. He accused me for making uh, that enemy, that enemy, by thunder, by fire. I command the fire of God. Let it die. Let it die. He is the cause of the problem that you are having today. Today, it is the cause of stagnation in terms of anything. Spirit of the Lord, you are a person who for him and I am a day. I remember the one I come back and he made a call you keep on them. Yak spirit of the Lord, you are a bad or yara. God from today, show somebody that mercy. A day in a day when you are in here, abandon taken because of seven and a day came on my own from where you are for room and you have one kind behavior so that the parents and the mother will see the child. As an enemy of the family. No good plan. From today, under that dominion, I liberate your life. I release God's goodness upon your life. That from today, anywhere you go, but today, because the power of the Lord is upon your life. Anywhere you go, goodness shall follow you. As a child in the family, from today, goodness shall follow you. People who denied you any good things of life, but because you have been liberated, you shall see good things. I need a man, you shall see good things. The boss and the person you are working for will show you mercy. I say, will show you goodness. Will show you goodness. Don't come from your Ibarra or Yara. Yaradi Canaba. In the name of Jesus. Give me number four. Number four prayer points. I purposefully repeat this prayer for us. Every evil agent supervising my destiny is a very important point. We will pray this prayer, this particular one, continuously. Every satanic, every demonic agent. Supervising my destiny must die. Mama, I better go. I better remember. Aban tenya na ma efara mi rakera. Ma, ndani komba ngadu duwe shiwe dong. Ete yagai sen teje nufuba. Yagai se uwa nyanyama. Ese su fongwe reka. I say, we should have been a man of God. We should have been a man I say, in your team, body don't get any. A man don't get any. I block. No face on the way you take. So far, you're in the army. And the army can take me on Kanam Zimbo. Kanam. I get one of my people on Kanam Zimbo. I'm going. I mean, no quite correct one. Said he got home. Said he got home. No. I for coming. Can a man on the way you know what you do? Church. Amen. Mbog da kara kukuri se da kara kukuri. Now I get NYAC, so I'm morning to. I saw a supervisor, who told him maybe I'm to go and Now I get JS1, and so said, I saw a may I promote. They are watching. I saw a may I buy wood and so up and May I not get it on one? And in progress. So that I might grab on board the moment of confusion. I saw a supervisor, you are a supervisor, you are destiny. What the Lord wanted you to be. Father, that spirit. That demon from my family that I'm coming from die. The community I'm coming from die. Hey, mama, you me, my mama, die. Even if my mother is the agent supervising my death, destroy her. Even if my father is supervising my destiny, destroy. <laughs> Don't worry. Time will tell. Raise up your hands. Raise up your hands. It's a prayer that you want to pray as if you would never pray before. Any evil agent, demonic agent, wishes and witchcraft agent, supervising my destiny, supervising when my promotion comes, supervising when my daughter's in law shall give birth, supervising when my child shall be getting married. Die! Die! Raise your voice and pray. Raise your voice and pray.
People upstairs, they raise your voice. As so I seen, he said, you may need admission. The time that they want to give you an admission, they are monitoring. Monitoring, monitoring, monitoring. Raise your voice and pray.
Manto ko yag hefne benesio. Seme na de agere bandara ma. Yag hefne nuwa isio. E tento pamma do tie. Azo ase. Mana pana gina do mana gen. E wa pana gina mo do do ndo. E ja ma ke mi ni apana pa do ndo mo itim do to mensan. Apana do ko to ko mi ko to ko mi ni agi wot. Morning drink agent. Morning drink your destiny. Morning drink your glory. Morning drink your goodness. In the heavenlies. And yes, in a king. And yes, in a cupboard. And yet, you are coming for today. Let it die. I'm not satisfied. I need shop amen. Let it die. Morning drink spirit in your family. Waiting and morning drink. It doesn't do it. I need admission. No more to put on my son, no more to run to run to run. I saw a senior even admission. I saw a senior confer cook bono. A certain degree, no what I item that agent today on this mountain I stand. I release the fire of God from heaven wherever you are in the heavenlies. Hear me and hear me well. Cast fire. Amen. Yem shaba men. Cast fire. Amen. Cast fire. Amen. And so I said no. I said yes. Yeah, I don't know. But when I don't know, yeah, I say in the air you don't know the I say in the air you don't know the man. You don't know the man. I'm not doing it. I'm not doing it. I'm not doing it. What's the name? Then your papa, papa, let it die. Let it die. Let it die. Let it die. Every morning, to any time, blessing is coming. Goodness is coming. Thing of joy is coming. Madam Boy Boy Akusong, today, today, this is the year, this is the month of divine goodness. Let them die. Let them die. From your mother's side, let them die. In your parent father's side, let them die. In the name of Jesus. I saw him on into business. I saw him on into career. Dang bisnes jadi nak belajar yang itu menjadi sen. Mfrem, kenda kamam, kenda kamam, kenda kamam. Ejen je siapa kau mai fak? Yang ikan ada, yang ikan ada, yang ikan ada. Ejen je siapa kau tu mendem? Ejen kau tu mendem? Yang ikan ada. Apa kau fak apa sih? Yang ikan ada. I don't want to be banned. Yari Kamata. As the go to Mampara, where you fought. Yari Kamata. As the go to Iban. Yari Kamata. Every morning drink agent. As a Mavaiske. Your destiny. Destiny of your children. Destiny of your career. And I release the fire. Let it cast fire. I hear you shouting fire. Shout fire. Shot fire! Shot fire! Shot fire! Let it cast fire! Let it cast fire! Let it cast fire! Let it cast fire! In the name of Jesus! In the name of Jesus! From today! From today! From today! Demon shall not supervise your destiny! Shall never supervise your career. Shall never supervise your dreams. Shall never supervise your goal. I beg you, Mr. Kanda. I say it again. If the father has one son, but a man in token can't be buried, shall die. Say yes, Mr. Menero. I say shall die. But the son shall succeed. The daughter shall succeed. The family shall succeed. I command and I release fire from above. Fire from above. Fire from above. Fire from above. I want to hear you shout fire. Fire from above. Fire from above. Fire from above. Fire from above. Let them cast fire. Let them cast fire. In the name of Jesus. No agents from now shall be in charge of your dreams. 
in charge of your son's destiny in charge of your daughter's destiny in charge of your husband's destiny in charge of your wife's destiny from today i speak into your goodness into, into your destiny receive the goodness of god 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 in the name of jesus can you shout fire three times so down on your career in sunny yeah can talk at 10 o'clock you know what i tell you that is the food you give us the last one hallelujah i reject every evil authority upon my life every evil authority at the moment you can get by me you can get by roof up so that more than sana money for a control women me a boy control women me even if i control women me you will reject it you come to pray okay let us read the prayer upon one to go that is nonsense the only thing that will possess you will be the holy spirit demonic spirit shall never be in charge of your life wishes and wisdom shall never be in dominion of your life hallelujah at the center of it all is your Mora bram kwa kwa sire na Kwa kwa ro na na ba And the center of it all Sire na kwa na
I refuse being controlled by the ancestral spirit. I reject to be controlled by my family covenant. I reject to be controlled by the forces of my father's family, the forces of my mother's family. From today, I announce that I am under authority of Jesus. Raise your voice and begin to make that declaration. Make that declaration shall never control my husband, shall never control my family. Raise a cry to the Lord. The Bible says, and the people of Israel sought the Lord, and he was found by him. Jesus come, he came down from heaven. When he landed, I 
Every spirit. Every authorities, principalities of darkness. They assign a more in the realms of the spirit. To be in charge, and they control the conduct. And they control the behavior.
in the day be blessed in the night be blessed as you are going out be blessed coming in be blessed so I stand on this altar today and I say I dedicate you unto God's faithfulness in the name of God the Father Give me the Son the Holy Spirit can you summarize it with seven thunders? Amen. When I did of the goodness of my Savior and all he has done for me I Praise the Lord. We'll take the announcements as I respectfully invite the church secretary.